forest fires in Europe will be more frequent and more intense. Scientists in the report of the Scientific Council of the European Academy ESAC, admits that Europe must learn to live with fire and forest fires will be more frequent and more intense. This is the result of climate change, depopulation of rural areas and changes in land use. ESAC calls for an urgent change of EU fire policy reactive dampen fires on proactive land management, based on risk assessment. We see a surge in many regions of Europe numbers of long-term droughts, leading to increased extreme risk the fires. Some areas may experience serious fires even every two years said the Professor Thomas Elmfist, Director of Environment at ESAC. Europe she will have to learn to live with fires and adapt society to a difficult, new reality. More than twice as much urban areas in Europe are at risk of fires than in North America Asia and Asia, he added. EU forest fires already consume an average of half a million acres per year almost twice as much as the area of Luxembourg. Changing wildfires in Europe by 23 scientists nominated by National Academies of Science, identifies complex causes the increasing risk of fires. Among them are climate change, depopulation rural areas and changes in land use. It is predicted that droughts and decreasing summer rainfall will double the risk of fires by 2100. Meanwhile, the abandonment agricultural land and uncontrolled growth of vegetation have created huge areas of flammable biomass. ESAC criticizes current EU policy for prevailing focus on fire extinguishing and crisis response. The report postulates the creation and integrated EU fire risk management system, putting greater emphasis on prevention. Simply extinguishing the fire is not enough. We have to remove root causes, fight climate change more effectively invest in fire resistant landscapes and engage society in life with fire she underlined Dr. Kathleen Stouff, CEO chair of the working group on the committee. The Fires ESAC ESAC draws attention to the need to strengthen capacity institutional, cross-border cooperation and better sharing resources between EU countries. The report presents three key messages and eight policy recommendations to change Europe's approach to fires. Urgent Indications Immediately at once implement climate and land use including new EU law or reconstruction of nature, with particular emphasis on the restoration of the rich in peatland coal and sustainable forest management. Incorporate in risk of fires in biodiversity conservation and afforestation plans to avoid accidentally increasing the vulnerability of new forest areas. Educate the education society in terms of resilience to fires especially younger ones generations, through dedicated public health and education programs the fires. The political recommendations. Investing in integrated fire risk mitigation, including controlled burning and fuel management. Apply to it nature-based solutions such as animal grazing and re-zero reforestation with native species. To accept the role of fire through controlled firing, maintaining balance it's an ecological one. Investing in education and communication, increasing fire awareness and readiness society. Investing in landscape management to reduce the vulnerability of land to fires and design landscapes that are more resistant to fire. Harmonize the sectoral policies in agriculture, environmental protection, and urban development to reduce conflicts and risks. To promote compact urban development, reducing the expansion of areas contact cities with wild areas. To encourage to manage private lands sustainably, supporting owners' land in implementing fire-resistant practices. Although the Mediterranean area is still a region the highest risk in Europe, the report warns that continental regions, Alpine and Boreals must prepare for the new era of fires. 
changing fire regime with larger, more intense fires it is driven not only by the weather, but also by structural changes the socio-ecological. Many new areas, such as Central Europe or rapidly warming mountainous regions, may be exposed to extreme conditions conducive to fires. This is a fundamental change with serious consequences for the environment and public safety, said Dr. Orsolia Vaco, CO Chair of the Working Group The ESAC Fires.